Hi everybody, so today we are down in my laundry room and Hannah is getting into everything. Hi! You say hi? No? Okay. Um, and I had some requests to show what I got at the consignment events this weekend. So this was the um, the haul from the first event, which was the, um, the name brand kind of upscale uh, consignment event. So first I got her these really cute pair of red shoes, red little Pat and Mary Janes. They're from Gymboree in a size 5, which is what she's wearing now. And I think those are $7. So very cute. Uh, I got her a pair of socks. Again, these are Gymboree. I like that they have a lot of colors, and they'll, so they'll go with a lot of outfits. Uh, those are 2 bucks. And then a pair of tights. Um, they're navy blue, and uh, that way she can get some more use out of her summer dresses. Anyway, all right, so this is a um, cute little long sleeve Gymboree top. Kind of makes it look like it's spring, but um, I think she'll get a lot of use out of this. That was $3. This was, um, most of these clothes are either going to be 18 months or 24 months, so I don't think I really got any two tees. This is another Gymboree top. It was $4. It's much thicker, though. It's much thicker. And long sleeves. I like the little smocking detail at the top. And um, a Gymboree sweater with a little cupcake. And then I got her the matching winter hat that also has a cupcake. This was $5 and it still has the tags on it. I like the cute little buttons. It looks like it would match those socks really well. Um, a lot of this is Gymboree. I, I like Gymboree stuff. So I got her this like one piece outfit. It's like a footed, it's not really pajamas though, but I just thought it was way too cute. This is from Crazy 8 with a little matching giraffe hat. <laughs> Chris looked at me like I was crazy when I brought that home. I think it's cute though. Oh, Hannah's having some fun. All right, so these are some super long, like long, uh, 24 month from Gymboree pants. And these are uh, from Old Navy and they're 24 months and they are ridiculously long. But then check these out. These were only like 250, I think. Look at these pants in comparison. Look at the difference. This is 12 to 18 month from Old Navy. This is 18 to 24 month from, what did I say, Old Navy? Yeah, so they're both Old Navy, which was the ridiculous part, because if you match up the waistbands, look at that. Is she really gonna grow that much between 18 month and 24 month? So I don't know if these are gonna fit. These look a little shorter, but I thought a nice pair of brown cords would be good this fall. They were $4 and they're in really good shape, so. Those are the pants, and then I wanted to show you some outfits I got her. This was like, excuse me, the bell of the ball right here. <laughs> it's a Janie and Jack four-piece outfit. So it's got a long sleeve um, little onesie that's got these little reindeer applique. It's got lapels. Yay, you having fun with my markers? Thank goodness you haven't taken the lids off yet. Uh, these are some red corduroy overalls with the same little reindeer little buttons. So these are pants. Very cute, little rickrack on the pocket. And then a matching kind of um, super soft, the reindeer motif sweater. And then a matching hat, a little poof ball on the top. So it's like the sweetest outfit ever. And I think she's going to wear this when we like go get the Christmas tree or something like that because it's just too cute for words. I love how the pants are lined. Everything from Janie and Jack is just heirloom quality. It can totally be passed down. You pay for it out the nose. I mean, don't get me wrong. This stuff is so expensive, but brand new, that is. That's why I never buy it unless it's a gift. But um, it's just too cute. And she wore a Janie and Jack little snowman outfit to get her first Christmas tree, so this will be kind of a cute tradition. This was only $12 for the four pieces, which wouldn't even have bought you the hat brand new. So there is that. It was like the steal of the day, almost. I'll show you the real steal of the day later. So this is a three-piece Gymboree track suit. She had a bunch of these when she, um, last winter, when she was, you know, in zero to three and three to six month clothing. But now that she's going even more places, I think she'll get a lot more use out of them. And I don't get me wrong, she got a ton of use out of those track suits as a baby. I'm going to all the doctor's appointments and stuff. Look at the little shirt, so cute, in great condition. I paid a little bit more for this, it was $14, but I know, like I said, that she will wear this a lot, so she looks good in green. Um, this is a Gymboree overalls, pair of overalls. Purple, it's uh, 18 to 24 months, so it'll probably be next spring before she can wear them, but they were only $3. So again, in really good shape since, you know, 18 to 24 months, usually they're not crawling anymore. 
uh, once again, you have nice quality on the on the knees. You have to watch it be at like uh, the nine month clothing, clothing, the twelve month clothing, and occasionally the eighteen month clothing. They look great up at the top, but then they're just threadbare on the knees. So it's kind of nice getting into these bigger sizes where they're in a little better condition, even though sometimes they're being worn longer. Kind of just depends on how um, big the rotation of clothing is. So this is a super cute little Scotty Dog Jimboree outfit. It's um, yeah, 12 to 18 months, new with tags, and this was $12. So this will probably be like uh, going to Santa or church somewhere around Christmas. I just thought it was really cute. Nice little sweater dress. Nice weight. Again, I do like Jimboree. Sound like a broken record. Jimboree <laughs> hot pink velvet dress. It's $5. Um, and like, yeah, it's just, it has a really nice weight. So I think like with a pair of tights and a long sleeve onesie underneath, it'll be too cute. I love the contrasting fabric. Even though you don't see it, you just know it's hip. So this, uh, little dress, it's from Gap. I love the brown kind of menswear, hound tooth kind of, um, material that it's made out of. And the great thing about it is that when she gets a little bit bigger, she could wear it as a tunic paired with um, those brown, where are you? These, there they are. The brown little leggings that I bought. And she'll get even more use out of this. That's not how you play with it, Hannah. Uh, anyways, so I like that even though it was $8 and it was a little thinner, it'll be a great dress for the fall and she'll be able to wear it into the winter and possibly even a couple days in the spring. So I like that dress, very cute. Same kind of idea with this. This is an Old Navy toddler dress, 12 to 18 months. And uh, she can wear it with tights and a long sleeve onesie, but then in the spring, if it still fits, which it probably will because the armholes are a little bigger, um, she can wear it as just a dress with maybe a little light cardigan over it. So I thought this was a good buy. Even though it was $8, it was a nice heavy weight. So I like that dress. So I never know how to pronounce this company. The girl that I nannied for, she used to wear this brand a lot. Uh, Narje? Narje? I don't know. We always go and look in the store and we can never find anything that we like. None of the color combos that we like. But I do, you know, the style of it is okay. It'll be a nice little play dress. It's long sleeve. It was $7, so it'll be good for her to uh, play around in. So there's that. I love this dress. Again, with the whole idea that a dress can be a dress and then it can be a tunic. Because um, it kind of looks like a tunic. This is from Gap. Uh, 12 to 18 months, I think. Yes, 12 to 18 months. It was $8 as well. But uh, I love the little piping detail. And again, throw a pair of leggings underneath this and she can wear it as a tunic when it gets a little too short. So, very cute. And this will actually transition even better into the spring. And uh, one of the last things I got was an extra small, brand new Thirsties Fab Fitted Diaper. Fits sizes 6 to 12 in yellow, so totally gender neutral. Velcro closure. The, um... So the pad is sewn in. So there's no stuffing, so you can't put a doubler in it. It's extra small. They don't really need a doubler at that age. You can fold this down if you want to, and then these Velcro tabs um, overlap enough that they can close onto themselves. So it can go down even smaller, especially if the umbilical cord is still attached. So although this diaper was $8, it's uh, $15 usually, so I'm slowly kind of amassing some newborn and small size diapers because I want to cloth diaper baby number two from birth. So, all right, so that is day one sells. Uh, there's one more item that makes the, everything worthwhile. <laughs> so let me go get that and I'll prepare um, day two sale that um, I went to with Jess and Ethan. All right, bye. All right, so you'll notice that some of the items that I bought, um, you know, like the dresses for $8 and stuff, a little more expensive than I usually um, go for. However, that's just kind of the price point of this sale. But it was all worth it because the bargain of the day was that I found an Arms Reach Co Sleeper. It is in a nice neutral color. I assembled it at the sale to make sure that every, you know, all the pieces were working, everything was clean, there was no rips, stains, nothing. And it actually came with two extra sheets. 
but it doesn't come with the riser, so I'll probably have to buy those separately. But it's okay that I splurged on the other clothing items because this is normally um, $120 to $140 in the store, brand new. And on, on Craigslist, which I've been looking for for like three years for one of these, um, I've never found one less than $75 that's in good shape or a nice color. But this one, I found in the back corner of the sale, the very bottom shelf shoved all the way in the back. So someone was hiding it. <laughs> and for good reason, because it was only $20. You probably can't tell that because this thing won't focus. 20 bucks. 20 bucks! That's the other reason why I assembled it, because usually if it's that low, there's something wrong with it. So I just kind of went over into the corner and pulled it all out of the bag and assembled it all together and it worked perfectly. So I'm stoked because basically I was going to buy this for baby number two, so I saved myself $100. So that's why I felt okay with paying probably maybe $30 more for the clothes than I would have liked to. But in the end, I totally came out ahead. So. That was my bargain of the day, and the people in line were jealous that I got an arm's reach, and then when they found out it was only 20 bucks, I think they were trying to uh, figure out how to steal it from me. So, <laughs> I am super happy and totally excited for baby number two. So, all right, so I started off the sale with um, a really cute pair of size 5 shoes from Kids Corner. I like that they are in fall colors with little girl accents. They look like they are nice quality, heavy weight, um, with really good soles on them, but I think that they'll be comfortable for her. So these were $7, just like the other little red Mary Janes that I got her. So I think between those two and a pair of white sandals, she should pretty much be done for the year. And I also have a pair of rain boots. So I think, uh, I think we're pretty good on shoes now. So I started out with some more uh, jumpsuits. Again, we end up wearing these things a lot in the fall because it goes from hot to cold. We're able to play indoors and then throw this on and go out and run errands. They just work great for us. This is a two-piece set for $8 from Gymboree. Um, brown, but has cute little flower accents up here and up here. So that was cute. Um, I got our another green one. This one looks like the legs are going to be a little longer. Uh, this was $9. I got it, though, because... <laughs> Um, I just thought it was really pretty. I love the contrast on here. Um, it was also a really nice weight. It was more like a sweatshirt. Whoa, Hannah, calm down. So I think this will be good. And then Hannah had some of these as a newborn. These three-piece sets from Carter's with the fleece pants that I love. I had these in every size where they were season appropriate. Um, but I had them in brown, just solid brown. Love them. So anyways, uh, Three piece, this is just I think a plain, yeah, plain white onesie, 18 months, with the fleece jacket. Hannah wore these all the time as a baby, so I'm excited that she gets to wear them again. This was $8. Um, now I also bought these pants separately, and these were $2.50 in, uh, let's see, they're child of mine, so basically it's an off Carter's brand, um, 18 months. The great thing about this is I'll go out, I'll take her out on the town for errands in this outfit, and then I'll pack these pants along just in case she leaks or spills something on herself. Um, I can in like instantly trade out these pants, and she can still wear the top. Um, so I like to have kind of multiple pairs of pants that go with an outfit, just because usually um, if she's going to have an issue, it's going to be a leak, not necessarily spilling something on her top. So I got those pants, and again, they're the fleece. They're super long. Look how long they are. So I think those will be great. These are some Gymboree leggings. These are $4. They have lots of great colors though, so they'll go with a lot of tops, especially like when it's red and pink together, because then I don't have to really worry about clashing at all. I got her a pair of these corduroy. They're from Old Navy, and uh, they were $3. They look nice and long, so I think that they'll fit her. They also look like they're fairly slim fit up at the top. Usually if I find pants that are long enough, they're too big up here for her, even with the cloth diapers. So I think that these will work. And then for church, I got her this nice velvet gray with the pink little bows on the bottom. They're fully lined. These are super nice quality pants. I really, really like them. They were $4, which is a great deal, and they're by um, First Impressions. <laughs> Hannah's playing with quarters. Okay, so this is a Gymboree sweater with a cute little bunny, and on the back it's got a little cottontail. <laughs> How cute. It's $4. Looks like it's in brand new. There's like no wear on this sweater. Uh, Jim Bree. 
This is Jimbree as well. <laughs> 18 to 24, so it's kind of big, but uh, the birthday girl is really cute. I love the colors. And I was trying to find a shirt for her to wear with her little pink tutu so I could take some pictures, and I think this will do the trick. And it was only three bucks. Yeah, and you know that if it says birthday girl, the kid probably only wore it one or two days, and then that was it. So, which it shows because it's got like no wear on it. So, hopefully that'll fit her okay. This next thing I got, Chris was kind of like, really? Because uh, he doesn't like the team, but his grandparents do. So, and I do too. <laughs> so I got it for, um, to take a nice little picture. It's a Green Bay Packers long sleeve shirt. I think it was super cute, like very girly. It came with a very cute little ruffly denim skirt. And it was $4 for the two pieces. So even if I paid that just for the skirt, I think it'd be worth it. But I'm excited to take a cute little picture for his grandparents. So, yay! Now, uh, the last thing I got there was some PJs. I love two-piece PJs. I think they're, they're great for Hannah, especially with how tall she is. These are from Carter's. It was $5 for the two pieces, and they do not show very much wear at all. So I think they were probably in a large rotation. So very cute. I haven't seen this color, color scheme before. Hi, yay, 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 yay. Hi, baby. Um, and then I got, hi, boo. It's all right. These are 18 months, $5. What? Up? Up? Okay. Hold on. Hold on, everybody. Ooh. There we go. All right. Yeah. So five point, $5 was about the price point for um, zip-up footed PJs. So basically what I did was I went through and I pulled every pair of um, zippered footed PJs. Um, Hannah, don't touch, please. And then at the end, I narrowed it down to the four pairs that I like. So I got this pair. Um, I got this one that says, love me. I got, <laughs> you just love touching this thing, don't you? I got this one, the flowers. This was $4.50. And this one was pretty cute. Pink, and it says sweetie all over it. Okay, so in the very last thing I got her, and I kind of hemmed and hawed about it, was this coat. So it's light blue, which didn't doesn't match her rain boots or anything, but um, it was a nice weight, and the thing I liked most about it, Hannah, stop, is that you can zip out the liner, and this becomes a sweatshirt, you know, it's inside out, a sweatshirt, and then you'll have a nice thin raincoat or you can zip it together and it's a nice thicker coat. So I think we'll definitely wear this on outings. We needed something to wear when we go apple picking. Yeah. So, and you won't see the this thing and unless she's wearing the sweatshirt. So when it's all zipped together, it's just a plain blue jacket, nothing on the back. And with your eyes, you look good in blue. Isn't that right? See, I look good in blue. Hello. Mm-hmm. So besides a few, a uh, couple books that I got her, that was all the clothes from the haul. It was my clothing haul from the two consignment events. So there is one at the beginning of October. Um, once I put her 12 to 18 month closet together and see if I'm missing anything, probably I need some more t-shirts um, and maybe a couple more pairs of comfy pants, but pretty much she's set. Isn't that right? Yeah, all your nice clothes are, are purchased. You say bye? Bye. <laughs> ah. Bye guys.